Let's go, let's go <laughs> down to Crownsville, Maryland, where Willard Scott is back at work after a week <laughs> off. Oh, my goodness. Good morning. <laughs> Army lords and ladies, welcome once again. They promised me I'd be at a white castle. I thought I had had hamburgers and some, some, this is ridiculous. <laughs> this, the Renaissance scene, the year is 1835, and you can pretend like you're having fun back in the days of, oh, I would say, uh, Richard III, uh, Henry VIII. We will have wenches, my wench is here. Come in here, wench. I want you to meet my wench. This is gonna be my date for the whole morning. Tough times back in those days. Let me tell you, folks, those were tough times. We welcome Hallmark, a great name in American cards, to our birthday salute this morning. And we will wish this morning for the first time with our new Hallmark card a very special happy birthday. And guess what? I don't, I don't believe it. Howard Johnson in all 37 flavors from Brookings, South Dakota, 100 years old today. A sincere happy birthday to a handsome man. Brian, he played golf until he was 98, still goes out occasionally and uh, checks the greens and still lives on his own. God bless. Happy birthday. Well, it's beautiful and warm and sunny almost all over the country, almost 85% of it, but it's cold. Look at Atlanta, Georgia this morning, 40 degrees with a wind chill of 30. We got Buffalo 38 and 22. There's some snow flurries and some rain showers around the eastern shores of Lakes Erie and Ontario. But look at all that sunshine and warm weather out west. It's almost, as I say, 85% of the country, very nice weather conditions. We will talk more about that and other goodies later on. And you will meet some of these wonderful folks who made this program possible this morning. They are a singing and dancing group, the 15th annual Renaissance Festival here in Crownsville, Maryland, between Baltimore and Annapolis. Now here's what's happening in your world, even as Milady speaks. Good morning, I'm meteorologist Alan Eustace. Monday promises to be partly cloudy, breezy, and cool for Washington with high temperatures only near 60 degrees. Tonight, scattered frost on the pumpkins, lows near 38. Tomorrow, mostly sunny, a little warmer. Highs in the mid-60s. That's it for right now. We'll be back with more goodies this morning. Don't you worry about a thing, Miss Scarlett. Everything is gonna be okay. Now back to Bryant, New York. We're gonna post a sign on you that says, dangerous when rested. <laughs> All right, well, thanks very much. 709 now. And I'm It's 8.07. That's the latest. Now here's Willard with today's weather. This morning's weather is brought to you by Choice Hotels. As Spencer Tracy said, what's there is choice. Let's have the, cue the trumpets. Fantastic. That's the way Brian Gumbel comes to work every morning at NBC <laughs> as he gets off his elephant. What a pleasure it is to be here at the Renaissance Festival in Maryland, not too far from Annapolis and the shores of the Chesapeake Bay. And speaking of the shores of the bay, Lanai and the beautiful island of Hawaii, we thank you for a lovely week. I was there for while well, the folks were down south in uh, uh, Orlando and Disneyland, Disney World, but uh, I just wanted to wear their little button because this is Welcome Home Week to all the folks from Lanai, uh, the natives, the folks who've lived there all their lives and their families, sort of like a big family reunion on that marvelous island with probably the most perfect weather in the whole wide world. It is my pleasure to be with the king and queen here. I, uh, Anne Boleyn, it's delightful to see your majesties. May I first of all show my respect? Certainly, sir. Your what ladyship. fine manners. Nay, my lord, tis our pleasure to have such a handsome gentleman in our midst this day. Good lord have mercy. I think me, me, me cattle lily is beginning to bloom in the spring here. Yeah. And uh, of course, Henry VIII, this famous world-renowned, likes uh, an occasional uh, McDonald's uh, double cheeseburger. And the king also, the king is a weatherman because the king reigns. <laughs> uh, <laughs> careful, sir, lest your shoulders become lonely for your head. Oh, oh. <laughs> me thinkest thou puttest me down. <laughs> what thinkest thou of the skins? <laughs> we do like much those knights that do joust in the burgundy and gold and are most pleased with their efforts this year. <laughs> in other words, dynamite. Oh, just wanted to check with you. This is the last show of the season, is that This right? will be the last weekend coming up uh, this final weekend, the 12th and 13th of October. And th these are for acting is part of it. You see great shows, but it's a lot of fun. It's got to be to go back and relive these moments. You can, when I was a little kid, I used to well, you want to be a knight or a king. Oh, 
indeed. Well, everyone likes to play dress up, and where else can you see such an assortment of amazing entertainments and foods and crafts and the like? I certainly will agree with that. Indeed. I've never seen such a sorted group in my life. All right, so. <laughs> Bring on the wenches. Uh, let's have a birthday, and then we will uh, uh, let the weather sort of flow forth here. Happy birthday with our Hallmark card greeting to Joseph Wyand of Hannibal Mo. Uh, almost all of his life, he's been a good listener and lives longer. He says, if you listen and don't talk so much, you'll live forever. I guess Henry would uh, attest to that, right? Indeed. We yeah. are good early age. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Happy birthday to Caroline Marshall of Duluth, Minnesota. Pretty lady who is 100. We wish both a happy birthday active and the uh, humanitarian and environmental efforts in the Duluth area. Now, here's what's happening. Would you say, sir, for all the local stations, the local weather, would you give them an introduction? Inst certainly, sir. By the weather by our own good Willard Scott. Thank you. That's a cut. Good morning. I'm meteorologist Alan Eustis. Monday promises to be partly cloudy, breezy, and cool for Washington with high temperatures only near 60 degrees. Tonight, scattered frost on the pumpkins, lows near 38. Tomorrow, mostly sunny, a little warmer. Highs in the mid-60s. And now, Sir Brian of Gumbel is standing by, ready to mount his steed for do something. I beg your pardon? Eating his humble burger. Thank you. 810 now. It's 8.34, time for Willard and today's weather. This morning's weather is brought to you by Lunchables Lunch Combinations. Lunch is what you make it. Oh, thank you, Joe, and a good time is being had by all. From Crownsville, Maryland, the 15th annual Renaissance Festival, just like it was in the old days. And what you're witnessing now is Michael Gardner and Michael Asner settling the Today Show bill at Disney World. And we knew they could do it if they got together. How sweet it is. I will draw my sword, except for one thing. I have a hernia, and I can't hold it. We are, I'll tell you what we want to do. Right now, I want to do a birthday, and then I'm going to do something that I have never done all morning on this program. Happy birthday from all of our Hallmark friends. Take a look, if you will, please. This is Ralph Cashin of Riverside, New York, 102. A good-looking man. Happy birthday to you, sir. And Jerry Sprague of Tom's River in New Jersey, wearing a jaunty little hat at 100, loves his gardening, loves to shop, cook, and even likes to do the dishes. He's been doing them for 100 years. He must enjoy. The week ahead, look for a few scattered showers around the Great Lakes, the upper Mississippi, back through the northeastern states. Maybe some wet weather down in Florida and more normal conditions throughout the southeast. Dry and mild, and we mean El Nino type hot down in California up in the valleys especially temperatures knocking around 90 this morning fog from Los Angeles all the way down to San Diego may cause a few delays but the sun should burn that off in no time 85 percent of the country is in enjoying sunny skies today almost perfect weather everywhere here's what's happening in your world even as we speak Good morning. I'm meteorologist Alan Eustis. Monday promises to be partly cloudy, breezy, and cool for Washington with high temperatures only near 60 degrees. Tonight, scattered frost on the pumpkins, lows near 38. <laughs> we, we have one final shot. This is a sword swallower. You do not do this at home. Oh, you want me to help you? Okay. Ugh. Okay. Oh, thank, thank you. Thank you. I'm you glad go. I got help. Here's one for you to try. Anybody right. can do that. That's nothing to it. Are you ready? Oh, yeah. oh, oh, oh. Good one. Good. Unbelievable. <laughs> Kids don't try that. That's dangerous. Nothing hey, to hey, it. Hey, hey. You're not Bring to me that. a winch before I leave here. Thank you, winch. Bless you, winch. Ha. Ah, ye old buffalo wing. <laughs> now back to New York. All right. Really? Mm. Delicious. Thank you very much, sir.